Hey everybody, Chris here, U-Joint Off-Road. Hopefully I'll make it through this video without hacking my lungs out. I think I've only got a little bit left. So, another brand new E450 Integra. This one is going to Dubai. It's not going to our normal customer or dealer over there. It's going to a new guy, which is cool. Pardon V6 interruption. So yeah, brand new 7.3 E450. <clears throat> Six inch lift on 33s. Custom spec springs front and rear as always. 285 70 17 recon grappler up front from Nitto on the American Racing Baja in black. Single Fox 2.0. Super nice building these brand new rigs because the frames start off so perfect and clean. And then we just add our little touch to it. You can see the new U-Joint Off-Road stickers on our springs, custom made by Alcan in Colorado. Up front, we got some upgrades. It's got our FB002 front bumper, all aluminum, made here in North Carolina. Baja Design lights, worn winch, worn shackles, OBA port, Anderson plug, <clears throat> Factor 55 thimble with an Agency 6 Fairlead Custom. Black grill with our smoked amber LED lights. Finishes off the look and basically de-chromes this thing 100%. 7.3 Godzilla, like I said, 6R140 behind that. And a new process 1128F T case with a slip yoke. There's that wonderful approach angle and aggressive push forward on the axle that you can expect from the fine fellows that you join off-road. Stage three front axle, 456 gears, Detroit True Track, Dynatrack knuckles, serviceable wheel bearings, spindles, all of the good stuff to give you the biggest brakes available. <clears throat> this does have OBA, like I mentioned. So we do a, a side port on these long RVs. We try to aim for about mid wheelbase. So you've got a front bumper port, you've got one on each side. So you can air up tires. Out back, machine Dodge 17 inch wheels, powder coated to match the American Racing with a 255 17. Direct mount sway bar links hiding back there with some single Fox 2.0s. And uh, that's it for this one. Drive shaft gets modified in the rear, new drive shaft for the front, and a uh, spare tire is in the storage bin. So, another brand new rig, ready to go home. I'm not sure where it's getting shipped out of. Normally they go out of Jacksonville. I'm not sure where this one's going because it's a new company. But we hope to see more business from them in the future. So, thanks for watching as always. Follow us on Instagram and Facebook if you don't already. If you have any questions about the RV or our, our process, put them in the comments or shoot me an email, chris at ujoinoffroad.com. As always, thanks for watching.